hi guys so I haven't been online for uh, about two weeks um, I just didn't see the need to do the 19 week because nothing new had really happened well uh, hello don't come say hello come in then say hello Mm -hmm. ah. Oh, come on then. Um, <laughs> sorry about that. So, um, nothing really new had happened between sort of the between eighteen weeks. Um, so I thought, oh well, I'll leave it a little bit. Um, and nothing really much has changed now, but I've had a scan uh, for my twenty week scan. And I have received majority of the Wish um, clothing that I um, purchased. So I will be doing like a little mini Wish and update together. Because if not, it would have only been like a two minute update. <laughs> so how I'm feeling, I feel alright at the minute. My SPD is getting worse. But D. Pete is my best friend at the minute. Um, uh, oh God, you know, the one thing that is getting worse is my memory. Like, I just keep, I'll be talking and then halfway through a sentence I'm forgetting what I was going on about. <laughs> so, DP is my best friend at the minute for my hips. I haven't really had any other symptoms. My appetite's coming back, so I am, I won't say I'm eating loads more, but... If I have a meal, I can actually sort of eat majority of the meal. Whereas before, I couldn't eat that much because it would just make me feel sick. Um, I have got this pain in like my ribs every time. Like, well, not every time I'm breathing. It's just like a weird pain. But I googled it, and it was something. It's something to do with your rib cage like opening for baby to grow. It's probably that. Um, See, this pregnancy, I'm trying not to be a worry wart and go to the triage or the hospital or the midwife all the time. Because I'm hoping... Hello again. Oh. I'm hoping that they will... Um... Right, there you go. There you go. Um, I'm hoping that they're going to let me do a water birth because that is something that I really, really want to do. And since we've decided that this is going to be the last child, I really want to try. But they've said because of my BMI, they wouldn't let me. But I've had no complications in this um, pregnancy. I don't have to take any medication or anything for uh, it. So I'm hoping they might just say, well, yeah, we'll give it a try. Um, and if not, then then it's a no. It's, if it's them just not giving me the chance that's the thing that annoys me the most like just give me a chance and then you know rule it out if it's not working but it's the not giving me a chance bit that's annoying me um my friend's in the same boat she's had three cesarean sections and she wants to try naturally this time because she wasn't given the option after her first um so um, she really wants to try and have a natural birth but obviously the, the problem is because she's had three and this is a fourth child they're saying that they won't let her but she really wants to so we're kind of in the same boat me and my friend so anyway I'll get on to scan pictures now I was hoping that at this scan they would be able to confirm that it is a baby girl. However, the baby did not want to lay in the correct position for them to check anything. <laughs> so the way the sonographer were telling me was the baby was laid like not on its back and not on its side, it was like just tilted. So I've got to go back in two weeks because they couldn't get the accurate measurements of the spine um, and they couldn't tell the gender because of obviously where the baby was laid so they did manage to get some photos but they're not 
the best of photos, but that's, this is the clearest. I don't know if you can focus. That's the clearest photo they managed to get. And that one. They, they just look the same to be fair. So those are all the scan photos that they managed to get. These are these. <coughs> oh bless me. Oh. Um, but um, yeah. So I've got to go back in two weeks to have another scan. Because baby it was being awkward. And no matter what they tried. They made me go to the toilet. They made me walk around for a bit. This baby was not budging. But. This baby's been awkward anyway, like, oh, honestly, like, <coughs> almost feels like the lay funny on my spine. And you know, like when you get like a shooting nerve pain, this is like a dull ache that goes up and down my spine. It's such weird, you know, like a bit of like a pressure. It's like a pressure pain. It's so weird. <coughs> I'm sorry if I keep coughing as well. I've had this horrible chesty cough thing. Right, so these are all like the wish bits and bobs that I got. I've just put it in my son's Lego box because it was just easier to carry. So I'll try and remember what they all were. I think I think they were all about two or three quid. I don't think I spent more than three pounds, like two pound and a pound postage. So this is one of the first things, well, like a little uh, snuggly. It's got like a little love heart on with a with a button, which I really felt really cute because uh, I, I am a seamstress normally, so I thought that was really cute. They had a little button on there, and it's really 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 soft, and it's only like a pound and a pound postage, so that was really good. Um, so I really like that one. So these are clothing ones. So I'll do it in the order that they actually came in. Oh, let me just take. So, because she's going, she's a summer baby, or will be a summer baby when she's born. I bought this little outfit. So it's just a little romper. It's got these little tassels on there, if you can see. There. It's got little flamingos on there. Now, the material is like a swim material. It's stretchy in the middle as well. Um, it's a bit like a swim material, but it, it's going to like breathe really easy in the summer. Like, obviously, it's a, if it's a really hot day. Um, and it came with a matching um, headband, even though I don't know how I'm going to put those bits on the red, but... But it looks a bit big for a headband as well, so but it's definitely not a belt. Um, it is meant to be a headband. So that's the first item that came, and that I'm sure that were about two pound and a pound postage. So this was the next thing that oh, uh, that size seventy in, I think it's European sizes that these come in. So that's size seventy. So I think that's technically meant to be newborn. Um, this is a size 70 as well. Let me see it now. Can you see it properly? There we are, it's a bit better. So this is another light little sort of romper. Um, and this, the only thing that I'm not keen on this is there's, there's no button at the bottom. It's, you have to obviously slide. There's poppers at the top, but you have to obviously slide baby in and out of the top like if you need to change a nappy every time. Um, it is only like thin cotton, but with it being obviously she'll be a summer baby, um, then I'm not too fussed because probably have a vest underneath anyway, uh, keep her nice and cool. But I just thought it's really adorable. I love the little flowers on there. So that's size 70 as well. This one. Da -da -da. Right, sorry. I have to help me undo this. See, I've done them all up just so then I don't lose parts. <laughs> so this one is like a oh, I don't know what you call it. Um, 
it's not a dress but it is a dress it's got a little unicorn on the front and this is the back and obviously that's the skirt so it's got like a little nappy cover and in there is the loop so you tie obviously this part in the back so then it kind of looks like that so this is made out of like the swim sort of material again but this is made out of like jersey like out of cotton lycra sort of thing so it's a bit weird um but it's stretchy again and this i don't know if this has got a size anywhere no i don't think what this is nope oh it does this one's a size 70 as well um so i think that's technically newborn but that looks quite big for newborn um so we've got this one this one's like one of my favorites this is so cute so i'll go to the right right now i have not so this is a size 80 so i think this one is a is this three to six or six six months so that's a cute little button down dress this is on the cotton so it is very thin oh hello again <laughs> sorry my son's on his scuttle bug coming going up down the hallway um it feels all right the only thing is like where they've sewn the buttons i don't think you'll be able to see it's a bit it's like fraying a little bit so i think i won't even attempt to take do the buttons i think i just kind of put it over a head um and then this is the little headband it came with as well um this this is just only thin cotton i believe could be wrong but uh, what is it yeah it's 95 percent cotton and um, five percent polyester so that i thought that was just adorable and again i think this one on like two pound and a pound postage I don't think I paid much more for any of them because I'm a bit of a tight skate. So this, so I don't know how they've done the size in this one, but this one, um, it says size six, so I don't know what size six. It's meant to be like the first size newborn. Um, this has got like little. Uh, petals in the bottom and it's got like little pearls on the top and a little thing there now we are going to um a wedding in september and i thought oh well you know i'll just get a little a nice pretty dress for then um <coughs> um so even if this doesn't fit in September, it should should still fit for when we go abroad in January. Um, but this one's really soft. It's like it's like t-shirt material, and obviously it's like the um, tool at the bottom with the little flowers. But yeah, that's really nice that one. And I got a matching headband as well. So obviously. These came separately, they didn't come together, I had to order that separate from this. But that is the headband that I got, and that was I think a pound and pound postage. So, that is all, well it's not all my wish haul, there is a few bits and bobs that I am waiting for. I don't think I'm waiting for any more clothing, it's more like, um, you know like them baby turbans and, um, well... <laughs> I remember um, but I'm sure I'll just throw them here there and everywhere whenever they turn up into a hall um, I have no idea what my son is doing <laughs> right so that is pretty much it for updates um, hmm. if you have any questions or anything let me know down below if you like this video please give me a thumbs up and I will see you guys soon.